Thank you for joining me. It's Lori Pizzazz Studios. I'm glad to have you here with me. And I'm gonna do a, a beach pour on a tile. Now this is a four and a quarter inch ceramic tile. And I recently did a clock, a beach pour on a clock. And I, I wanted to do um, a tile with a little bit of the leftover paint that I had. So I will leave a video, um, a link to the video for the clock for you if you wanna see that. And I'm gonna go ahead and start this one here. This is gonna be the tile. Since I had some paint left over, I thought I would go ahead and um, use it up. I don't have a lot of it, so it was probably just enough to do this tile. I really love making these. They're actually really pretty. Um, they make wonderful gifts too. I actually have a beach home in Florida and um, these would be beautiful down there. So I'm thinking I'm gonna have to take some of these for myself <laughs> and keep them for myself and bring them down there. I have a lot of colors here mixed up that are custom colors. Like the color here of my sand is actually just a custom color. I have mixed up, it's not a straight brown or anything. It's uh, probably three different colors mixed together. I did put a little bit of metallic in it because I wanted a little bit of the shimmer in the sand, which I think is really pretty. It reminds me of when the sun reflects off the sand, so it'll have some shimmer to it. And the same goes for my other colors. Most of those are custom colors as well, except for my cell activator, which is just white. And I have one blue that is just uh, Liquitex Basics Turquoise Blue. So it looks like I might have even had enough paint here to do two tiles, actually. So maybe I will. We'll see when I'm done with this one. Maybe I'll go ahead and do another one. So I'm gonna just pop my bubbles here. It's only a couple. Yeah, there's not a lot of this blue left, so I probably don't have enough to do another one. Um, this is one of the custom colors I was referring to. This is basically just a combination. I think I added some gray in here. It makes it more of a navy blue instead of just like a bright blue. I'm gonna make sure all my edges are covered here. If you have any questions or anything please leave them down in the description box i'd be more than happy to answer them for you i appreciate you watching and viewing and subscribing thanks everybody i appreciate you watching and hitting that like button it means a lot to me that you take the time out of your day just to hit the like button and if you want to share my videos with anyone else i'd appreciate that too Okay, I guess that's that for that one. Whoop, just dropped my stick. All right, so now other colors I have are going to be turquoise, like I mentioned, turquoise blue. I'm gonna put some of this down here. throw down um, this is my other custom color I have mixed in there is a little bit of um, an iridescent paint in here so it does have a little shimmer to it Probably, well, I don't know. I may embellish this tile afterwards. I have all my pieces for sale on my website, pizzazzstudios.com, if you're interested. If you see something that is sold out and you uh, would like something, feel free to message me. I 
I will do commission work. And um, if you see something, if you want it in a different color, perhaps, or anything like that, feel free to contact me. My email address is also down in the description box for you. All right, so I'll just go ahead and torch that lightly. And now, this is one of the tiles I made. I showed this also in my clock video. But this is a tile that I made and I embellished with um, a turtle. So this is what I'm going for. That's this kind of look here. So this one, I don't know if I'm going to embellish it. I probably will. Because I enjoy embellishing my paintings a lot. So I will go ahead and probably embellish that one as well once this dries. So my swipe tool today, I'm going to use, I'm going to swipe this this way and um, I'm probably going to turn this around actually so that it's easier for me. That way I can swipe it towards me instead of away. I have better luck that way. But I just have this plastic card that I cut up into this a smaller piece. So I'm going to use that and I'm just going to get myself a paper towel. you want to wipe off the swipe tool in between swipes so we're gonna come up this way I'm wondering um, I have to look at this for a second all right I'm gonna do this sort of at an angle so I'm gonna come up this way I'm just gonna start I don't know I guess I'll just start in the middle I'll speed this part of the video up for you. Okay, this is looking nice. Let me just turn this around here again. Make sure all your edges are covered nicely. This is looking really nice. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, blow a little bit here in the section at the bottom here. Okay, this looks really nice. I'm gonna add just a little bit more sand here. Add just a little bit more white around the bottom here where the water meets the sand. very nice. I'm going to torch this. I'm going to remove any excess paint from the bottom of my tile. I don't have very much. I didn't have a ton of paint up on there in the first place. I think this looks really nice and I'm very happy with it. Let me give you a close-up. Okay, so here's a nice close-up for you. Let me zoom in a little bit here and get my phone in focus. <laughs> I really like how this turned out. Very pretty. Like I said, the sand has a little bit of a shimmer to it as well. So this is going to be really pretty when it dries. It will be very similar to my other one. I really like how this came out, though I like the colors a lot. Very pretty. I really enjoy making these very much. So I will show you one more time here, the other one, if I can reach it here. I appreciate you. Thank you for watching. Hope you have a wonderful day.
Bye for now. We'll see you on the next video.